What's going on guys? Welcome back to Fury Farms. Now on this one Um All I've done is I've jumped on and I've got farm nineteen getting some work done to it. Uh I've just seen it say fasten seatbelt. Huh, I don't get it. Oh, right, whatever. Right, so. While Farm 19 uh, is doing, we are going to look at what we can do over at the two farms where we've been gaining experience. Now, before I go any further into the episode, I would like to say a big thank you to everyone who watches my videos. It means a lot. And please don't forget to hit that subscribe button for plenty more to come um, people who if you view the video it takes two seconds just out of your time hit that subscribe button lets me know that you want to watch more um, and it gives me a lot of support so if you press the subscribe button and you're coming back to my videos thanks for that if not don't forget to hit that subscribe button now what we did on the last episode if I remember rightly because I do watch my episodes back um, like I'll do an episode and then a couple of days later when I do the recording of the next one I sort of I, I'll go over what I did and I'll watch the episode back but I only vaguely caught a little bit of what I did um, and I know that I did that farm last time I, I, I went over that farm with the slurry tank so this one is plowing See now it says plowing, I'm not a big fan of that. I don't like plowing it. It's gonna get 16 grand. Um it's gonna take 40 minutes, but I personally don't want to plow a fuel. So I don't think we're gonna be doing this one. Um Yeah, I don't think we're gonna be doing that one, so because to me East I do most of my stuff at the minute, I'm doing it all for profit. And then to get profit, plowing's not a profitable thing because you, you potatoes or you beetroot or stuff like sugar beets, sorry, not beetroot. Um, stuff like that, you're not gonna get um, you're not gonna get much money from when you sell them in the in the shops or you sell them to the people who, who want to buy your crops your harvest they're not sugar beets and potatoes don't sell for much so that's one reason why I won't I don't do it and plus the fact that I don't like plowing plowing to me is boring now if I look at this uh, potatoes I think the, this is potatoes here 300 and 200 no one's gonna want to do that sugar beets 200 two, there's no point in doing it this is the best one at the minute that I've seen. Soybeans, uh, canola's always been one that's been up there. And sunflowers. Now sunflowers I'm not sure how to plant. That's definitely one I want to look into. Right, you've got a, a bit of the way to go. Um, sunflowers is definitely one I want to look into. But again, I'm not sure how to do it. What I'm going to do is, because I've got 160,000. Um, I know I said I was going to do it at 250 uh, when I hit 250,000 but I'm going to go and look in the shop to see what the difference is between the two vehicles um, I'm also going to look to see if there's something that we could buy like a new machine or a new tractor or you know, something for a decent price I mean some of the times it is just best to lease it but leasing it does a daily cost obviously it's not a majorly big daily cost but again I prefer to own it so what we're gonna do first of all is look at the cars um, this rodeo the pickup pick up rodeo does 74 miles per hour um, it's, it's not too bad it's 20 pound a day and this one, sixty pound a day. 
just has more brake horsepower. Dude, this is the, the, the difference is is the looks is what I, what I can think of is like because the pickup rodeo and then you've got the pickup TT the only difference is the look they both go the same amount of speed you pay more for the TT so I think we're just gonna stick with what we got so with that being said we want to be looking into silage and stuff like that no, I think that's what we could start looking at. Going around cutting grass, getting silage, what have you. I mean, a truck would be a good thing to have. But again, truck trucks are pricey. Very, very pricey. I mean, dude, if out of any of the trucks I'd go for, I wouldn't go for a Lizard. It'd either be the, the, the Tatar or the Tatra or the Man. Um, and it isn't because of the speed. Because them two do fire. And them to do 49. It's because they look better. In my eyes, a man truck or a Tatra over lizards look better. Other people might have different, but or different opinions. But again, it's just my opinion. It's just what I think. Um, so looking at it, forestry equipment. I'm not big on because it doesn't give you much in money. Um, low loaders, no. Header trailers, no. See, I think we've got what we need for now. Uh, other than upgrading tractors, like getting the, the Massey Ferguson, that's a really good tractor to have. Uh, it's like the best tractor I had. Um, Helper G seems to have finished his task, so what we're going to do, because this pickups are actually quite nippy uh, if we go back to the farm and turn it yep. little mini shortcuts right. see this tractor could do with a clean while I'm clean now I'll speed up the time uh, doesn't go very fast but yeah I was looking to try and get a hold of the Massey Ferguson because again that was like one of the best tractors I, I used to use it a lot uh, on Farming Simulator 15 is it? FS15 yeah it's 15 because it's 17 16 was on the phone which I actually I'm pretty sure I have it on the phone. Uh, I'm doing a couple of bits and bobs every here and there and everywhere, so it's trying to figure out what I've got and what I'm not. I've got to upload a video from the phone at some point as well. Um, so that's all good to come. Right, so we've sped up the time. Let's wash down the tractor. Lord knows it needs a wash down. And as we're washing down the tractor, um what's gonna happen is once 19 and 14 are fully grown uh we're then going to get our tractors on work or working and once they're working that means we can look into the other ones and possibly he's plowed it um i know like i say it's 16 000, it's a lot of money and it will help me towards what I want to buy but again it's plowing and plowing isn't it's not it's not fun it really isn't fun to plow um, it's a bit boring it really is I mean I've I've talked to loads of different people um, some people hate this game that I've spoken to because they said it's boring and I've had I've had people turn around to me and say oh it's a really good game you know I've I've heard loads of different opinions from people to be honest with you the only opinion in my eyes that matters to me is my opinion of a game um don't and I know it's like the way I mean is 
if you like a game and like say one of your friends doesn't like that game then in that's their opinion and if they turn around to you and say oh well don't play that game because it's crap well again that's their opinion uh, if you like it play it don't ever stop playing a game because someone else doesn't has said that it's not a very good game um, I've done that once or twice with a couple of games and I won't do it again I play this game because I enjoy it I record it because I enjoy it it gives me something to do it's a challenging thing I challenge myself every time I turn this game on any game I play I challenge myself um, this is a challenge because like personally with me it's Fury Farms this is my farm my, I'm building my business and that that's the challenge now from what I can see this dude looks like he's plowed his field so does he have a job for us alright ooh interesting I've got a bit of a situation and you may be just the person to help see I've got to spend some time prettying myself up for well never you mind what for Point is something's come up and I need to look my Sunday best and now I need someone to pinch hit for me and sell a field right hang on um, he wants his field sewing I get 10 grand for sewing it does this change no pretty in myself up something's come up I need to look my Sunday best so now I need someone to pinch hit for me and so I feel you help me and I'll help you to the tune of 11,000 sound good um it's in 27 minutes when it's, it's sowing it's planting now I've, I can't what I could do um is I could do that mission why does this feel like it's been harvested? Yeah, I could do that one. Um, that one's fertilizing again. I think if I do this one, and then on the next episode, if I don't speed up the time now and I do this one, by the time I've done this one, this episode will be finished. And then when we come back in the next couple of days, we should have that one still to do. Um... I think that's what we're going to do. Because this one's just fertilizing. Now, fertilizing isn't that bad of a thing. It's quite easy to do. Even though it doesn't look like there's anything here to fertilize. Might do that. This is a nice looking tractor, though. I think that's getting it all. But yeah, this tractor is a nice looking tractor. I'm not sure what type of tractor it is, but it is a nice looking tractor. Um, so yeah, like I say, we'll do this one. Um, and then when I log back on the server in the next couple of days to do the next recording, we'll get that other job done, which can get us a nice pretty wage. Right. So, if I do it this way, I don't think I'm going to get it fuller, I'm not sure. No, I miss a, a, a line, or a strip, whatever you want to call it. But then again, I don't, for some reason when I'm doing this, I think it's because the actual farm itself is on a hill, so it's never ever straight. Um, or it could just be my bad driving. That's all it could be. Uh, Let's toggle some lights here so you can see a little bit better. Uh, this is definitely an interesting way of fertilizing using a slurry tank. I'm going to have to get myself... Like, some farm animals would be good to do so at some point. Like, picking up some cows would be good. Because then they can make some more slurry. 
but then I've got to pick up a slurry tank um, I've got to figure out how to fill a slurry tank then obviously you need the weight on the front of the tractor so you need, I need to buy a new tractor as well as a weight so there's a lot to put into it and it does like it could be an easy an easy way because I think with the farms I've got they are small or some of them are small so like I think I'm pretty sure in one of the videos that I've done or one of the episodes I've done on farming simulator um, we've got we used like a massive huge slurry tank and it was to do farm 23 it was like the biggest tank I've ever seen and it fertilized quite a lot quite fast now we got a lot of money for doing that uh, I think we got like 25 to 30 grand but it was a huge piece of equipment now if you used to own that said piece of equipment it probably cost you a pretty penny to to buy but you could get like because I own farm 19 and 14 I could probably get like um, them done in two back and forth 14 probably one one shot 19 probably back and forth two times because it was that big and it actually looked really interesting to use or well it didn't like I said it didn't look interesting to use it was a very very good trap um, slurry tank it was huge very huge so if you miss that episode there is um, you can click playlists on my channel and it's got farming simulator is it farm no it's fury farm season 2 2017 if you go to that it'll give you the full playlist of um how many episodes i've done and you can watch all the episodes there and catch up on what i've done and like sort of it's like a progression way of me finding out how to do stuff on this one because there's a lot of difference between this one and 2015 and i never knew that at the start i just jumped straight into it um, when it got released so it, it is a definitely a fun game and the playlist is it's definitely good to watch the season from the start season one is I think it's Sandy Bay on Fury Farms Farming Simulator 2015 that's season one is Sandy Bay and then we went from Sandy Bay we went to oh what was Beyond Home and them were fun they were fun ones to do I enjoyed them ones uh, and that was season one season two is 2017 so and it is Sosnovka and, and like I say in them episodes I've come up with like a little side plan of if people want to interact with me and people like this game and they want to play it like together as an online theme thing what, we, what I'm thinking about doing is if I get a decent amount of comments um, saying that they want to play alongside me and you got people going on that and subs like, even if you're not subscribed and you just watch it anyway and you want to play alongside then just let me know in the comments and by that point I can set up a server to let people come on onto the other map where we can build up our own little business as a community right so that doesn't look too nice does it what happened there right well we ended that and we got about four thousand four and a half grand um that's literally where we ended up with so we got four and a half grand for that job now when we come back like i said um in the next episode which will be in the next couple of days I record it uh, because I've got so many things going up at a time it's like I have certain days that I record certain things so after this one I'm going to record like construction simulator 2015 uh, and then I think after that it's a League of Legends and then tomorrow I've got more recordings and then the day after that and I rotate all the recordings because I've got like two four Six, seven games I alternate through it, at the minute it'll drop down to six for the next couple of two weeks three weeks maybe but it'll go back up to seven because one of them sort of like not 
you'll understand if you watch all the games that I do but one of them I have to wait for the updates for it to basically be recorded but other than that I do it like it's every three to four days I'll do a recording so when I come back to the next one um, to do the next recording then I will look into doing that job that like I said that was going to take like 27 minutes hopefully it's not going to take that long and hopefully we can get it done but for this episode we've done a decent amount of earning a little bit of money um, so yeah it's been eventful so I'm going to end the episode here and I thank you all for watching it's been a pleasure recording it for you I've been Fury, stay amazing don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I shall see you next time